I made these sketches as part of a daily exercise this spring where I was trying to paint anything without planning it. I really wanted to try to get more in the habit of making art every day because I made a lot of paintings last summer but it was hard for me to stay in the habit. Like I would paint most days for a couple of weeks and then take some time off and then just do off and on for a while. So this spring I started doing daily sketches in watercolor. Actually, I believe this is gouache paint. So I just would grab a postcard and then start drawing. I guess I was going for just kind of having simple compositions with pleasant aesthetic balance and messing with some different color things. But basically I was just experimenting and it's kind of like this, I don't know if you've heard of morning pages. It's a creative uh, tool that people use where you sit down and you fill out three whole pages with anything that you can think of and it's handwritten stream of consciousness. It could be like getting your grocery list done for the day or your to-do list or it could be things that you've had on your chest or just writing over and over. I don't know what to write but you have to fill up three pages and so by the end you're really incredibly likely to be, if not like coming up with something really creative, at least thinking of ways not to be so bored. So by making these, the first one with the three circles, I really liked it. But then in this one, I hated this one so much. I think um, I used too many just plain old geometric basic shapes and I couldn't stand it. But I forced myself to keep going and try to layer things and salvage it. Um, and like I ended up making freaking basketball but I painted over that too so by the end it was something that I, I didn't hate um, I think if it was a giant composition on a wall it might actually be a pretty cool abstract and so that allowed me to uh, I don't know be nicer to myself and so then I went on to paint this one which is inspired by the evergreen tree that I can see outside my window in my neighbor's yard. Um, I say inspired because it's definitely not realistic at all, but a lot of the basic elements like the, um, not a seed pod, but, oh, I can't remember what that's called. Maybe it is a seed pod. Um, and then the fronds of the, like, basic kind of pine needles and in general, nest kind of look to each of the branches um, so I, I tried to loosely use those elements but then I wanted to use a rainbow color scheme because I keep watching like Guardians of the Galaxy and I have a friend who has the most amazing rainbow hair and I don't know I'm really inspired by full spectrum rainbow color art lately so I wanted to do that in this little piece. Um, yeah, so these are sketches to get me going and not meant to be something that I sell or that I hang on the wall, but just to try something. Um, and you know, if I like it, maybe I'll turn it into some surface design pattern later, like for a fabric or a sticker or something. Um, I definitely need some more practice with my line work. Um, maybe it's the quality of the paint, or maybe I don't know how to use this brush. I think this was a brand new brush. And I keep having trouble with these. The hair keeps falling out. So I don't know if I'm being too rough on them, because I don't think they're like cheap, crappy brushes. I'm going and getting them at the art supply store here in Tokyo. Um, and they're not the cheapest ones, so I don't know. Maybe I need to look up some YouTube videos about that. Yeah, so that's three little sketches and 
I'll be uploading a few more soon because I basically amassed a huge collection and then didn't do anything with them for a long time because I couldn't think of what to say. I was too up in my own head, but I'm coming back out of that place, so thanks for watching.